so hi guys we all know that the supramalleolar flap is a very versatile flap for lower limb reconstruction in this video let us see the planning of the supramalleolar flap so we have a defect on the dorsum of foot for which we are planning the supramalleolar flap let us begin with marking of the important landmarks we mark the lateral malleolus we mark the head of the fibula and line joining the head of the fibula and the lateral malleolus is marked that is the fibula that is the axis of our flap then what we are palpating right now is the shin of the tibia on the medial side so we mark the lateral border of the tibia somewhere below that would be the tbls anterior muscle so these are two parallel lines between which our skin paddle is expected to lie the pivot point is marked at 5 cm above the lateral malleolus that is the area where the perforating laterally what is the distal extent of the flap literature is divided on that some say it is half of the limb length but in our experience we can safely go beyond half probably up to 2/3 but exact studies are lacking 